How you doing? Welcome to The Vinyl Dump. I'm Mike Shu. Today we're going to look at E Pluribus Funk from Grand Funk Railroad. As you notice, it is in the shape of a silver coin. Silver dollar? Quarter? If they could have a silver million dollar bill, that's what this would be. It says E Pluribus Funk right here, like, you know, instead of E Pluribus Unum, one for all, but this is, this is funk for all, okay? Funk for all, all right? So uh, this was released in 1971. Grand Funk Railroad released two albums in 1971. Uh, that's how hot they were at the time. They were skyrocketing at the top. They were selling out stadiums. People were just getting wasted and making babies at their concerts. They're just one of those bands that never really made it out of the 70s. Uh, but what I love about this album is just, it's shaped like a friggin' coin, man. I mean. I love this because I could see Grand Funk Railroad all hopped up on lewds and cocaine and drinking whiskey and talking to the record label guys going, hey man, uh, I want an album that looks like a big silver dollar and I want our faces on the front like instead of George Washington. I mean, check this out. There they are. There's, a, there's a Don Brewer and uh, Mark Farner and the bass player who I don't know his name at the moment, but I don't think it really mattered. And over here, you can see uh, just a slight imprint of uh, Shea Stadium. They stuck that on there because they had recently sold out Shea Stadium. Setting a record, they sold out Shea Stadium faster than the Beatles. Grand Funk Railroad did that. Do you believe it? Of course, this contains many, many hits like Foot Stomp and Music, and that's about it. But still, uh, a great album and really an underrated band from the 70s. You really have to be just faced on Ripple and Bad Hash to really enjoy this band and really. There's nothing wrong with that. E Pluribus Funk by Grand Funk Railroad here on the Vinyl Dump. Hi, Capitol Records. Grand Funk Railroad. Hey, listen, we're selling out stadiums. We sold out Shea Stadium in like three minutes. Our next album has to be in the shape of a silver dollar, all right? And it has to be circular and it has to be filled with weed because we love the fans. Yeah, yeah, woo!